you still recording it? Hey, you still recording it? Day one. Oh, lighting designer. Jimmy, he's recording. Jeremy, you freak out. What is this at the end? Yes, it's us, Jeremy. You don't freak out. Don't freak out, okay. Think of us as a little gateway. Yeah, there are people who like grand things and there are people who are intimidated by things that are on a grand scale. Think of us as the little company that finds these left out people. Lah. The idea of why the audience is so important is because we want to connect with them and from them we get the next story that we want to tell. Yeah, without these stories, basically the company would just be floating around singing the same songs and um, you know, we'll lose what we're all about. The difficulty of performing in this space is extremely high. It is a leap. And I think, as of now, we have managed to surpass the gap. One of the most challenging part is how the musicians get together within a very tight schedule and working very closely together with the singers uh, in the whole production. I think for our first production, Spot is doing quite well. Uh, it started as four people and then it became five and then suddenly boom, it became 20 plus people. Um, of course, the team that's running the production is not that big. Uh, so I think it's quite an interesting development uh, of Spot so far. It definitely came with challenges. I actually memorized the first, um, the first draft before I found out that we were actually changing all the words and I have to go and memorize again. So I mean that was um, I guess a good experience lah. I like obviously <laughs> Yeah, it's uh, I like grip sleep. Because it's those gun high gun hand high. I like Daisy, I think it's a lot of money. The police uh trans uh. <laughs> it is definitely different. The hierarchy system is very different. In a, in a typical opera company, somehow because it is the art of opera, the hierarchy system is quite prominent. It is quite common in many opera companies everywhere. But in Sport Pocket, none of that happens. The producers are singers themselves. The artistic director is a performer as well. So everyone relates and communicates in a way that is accessible to everyone. And there is no sense of hierarchy in that. So, for me, that is something very valuable. I hope it stays that way. It's a good experience, yeah, a lot of fun. Uh, I think everybody enjoys working together. Great chemistry. Yeah. Stressful at times, but really rewarding as well when we see the whole team come together. Good fun because we have made a lot of new friends, you know, with the cast and the crew. Not the cast, sorry, they were already my friends, but the crew. Jeremy, yeah. Yes! He's very spontaneous. <laughs> <laughs> what? Is He's this? also very funny, la. Like, he, he will turn the script into from something serious into something funny, something that we can laugh about. So, so I appreciate his humor. So I'm a joke lah. <laughs> In a sense, yes. <laughs> the cast is great. Um, I would always want to work with them again. They are very dedicated lah. Very sincere performers. Uh, not about themselves at all. They give themselves to the audience. And that inspires me a lot. I learned quite a lot actually from Whitney. First rehearsal, she seems to really know half of whatever uh, is written down and memorized. Yeah, all the shit. <laughs> then I realized, ah, there's gonna change. There's gonna be changes. Hang, I never memorized. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about when I say Jeremy is very spontaneous. <laughs> Thank you. What was the question? <laughs> Spot is like a family. Spot is family. Spot is family. <laughs> Spot is family. Sport is family. Sport is family. Sport is family. Yeah. 
What the hell is this? <laughs> yes, it's us, Jeremy. You don't freak out. Don't freak out, okay? <laughs>